More police officers will be deployed to Times Square after a tourist was shot over the weekend. It's the second shooting in, his, in, in the area in as many months. Now, this noon, as investigators search for a suspect, the mayor announced a new safety plan. Here's CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge with details. Police are looking for this man in a multicolored hoodie. Investigators say he pulled out a gun and fired at least one shot in front of the Lion King Marquee at West 45th Street and 7th Avenue around 5.15 Sunday. We heard a loud pop and then you saw people run into the Marriott. The suspect's target, police believe, was someone in a group of six men he got into an argument with. Instead, the bullet ricocheted and hit an innocent bystander. He was standing up, he was talking. Right. Um, and then they just put him on the, on the stretcher and took him on. Cell phone video shows 21 year old Samuel Poulin being treated by EMS. He appears alert as he's wheeled to an ambulance. Sources say a bullet hit Poulin in the back. He was taken to Bellevue Hospital with non life threatening injuries. Poulin was visiting the city from upstate New York and is a U.S. Marine who just graduated from the Citadel. That's really, really awful. You know, um, we love everybody that comes to Times Square. We welcome our tourists. We love them. And it's really unfortunate, like, something like that happened. Some people who work in Times Square tell us it's been overrun by crime and violence is happening too frequently. Last month, three innocent bystanders were hit by stray bullets a block from Sunday's shooting. The injured included a four year old girl and a tourist. Mayor de Blasio and the NYPD announced this morning they're taking action using uniformed and undercover cops. Times Square safety action plan to make sure that anyone who goes to Times Square knows they're safe and they're going to see plenty of police presence in Times Square. Making sure we're uh, not just having the Omni presence out there, but we're going to make sure we engage the individuals that are part of this uh, aggressive solicit, uh, solicitation, aggressive panhandling. So far this year, there have been 680 shootings compared to 444 last year. That's an increase of more than 50%. In Times Square, Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News. And as Natalie mentioned, shootings are up more than 50% around the city from this time last year. This past weekend was a violent one for the city. From Friday to Sunday, 23 people were shot in 19 separate shooting incidents.